Hello sports fans and baseball fans and fans of the Sportsman Z YouTube channel. It's me, Sportsman Z, the man. The one that you're uh, the runs a channel that you're a fan of. So I'm here with a channel update. I figured it's about time for one of those. And, um, uh, you know, um, just to let you go know what's going on with the channel, what I've got going on, what projects I have currently going on, things that are coming down the pike pretty soon, um, you know, that kind of thing. So you can be on the lookout for whatever you want to see from from me. And, uh, and by the way, I always take requests. Anybody has a request, let me know. If it has something to do with baseball, hockey, or football, I can probably accommodate. Certainly with baseball, I can. So anyway, um, let's talk about what we have in ongoing in real life sports. We have the ongoing NFL picks videos that I do every week where I give you my picks for the coming NFL uh um, slate of games and who I think is going to win each of those games and a little bit about why I think, you know, I would pick the team that I pick. Of course, now, you know, you're not going to get any in-depth stuff. I'm not going to talk about, you know, linebacker matchups and I'm not going to be up on the latest on the injuries, but, you know, you get a kind of an overview of what I think and why I think the teams that I say are going to win are going to win. So that's that's one thing. And that's usually on a Wednesday, but sometimes it's Tuesday night. Sometimes it, you know, maybe it could be Thursday morning. Who knows? Uh, but I do that every week. Uh, NFL picks. So now going to our replay, the replay world. Uh, let's talk about seasons I have going on. Right now I'm doing an out-of-the-park baseball season for the Kansas City Royals of 2023. You might want to go check that out. Um, I've done a few uh, videos for the 2023 season. The latest one was game 79 of the season. And uh, um, interestingly, the, the uh, Royals of that replay, of that out-of-the-park game replay, are doing better than the real Royals. They're on a pace to have more wins than the actual Royals of 2023 did. Now, in that, um, if you're familiar with out-of-the-park baseball, you can be the general manager, you could be the manager, or you could be all three. Um, or you can be both of them, as, as Kurt Berglund says. There are, <laughs> there are people that are good at math and... That there's three kinds of people in the world, people that are good at math and people who aren't. But <laughs> um, anyway, so out of the park, uh, Royal season 2023, I'm just the manager. I am not the general manager. I don't, um, with the modern day baseball and, you know, all of the salary caps you got to stay under, and, uh, and particularly with the Royals. The reason I chose the Royals is because I don't see a lot of Royals out of the park uh, seasons out there, playthroughs. So I decided I would do the Royals. And I did the White Sox for a few, quite a few, maybe three, four seasons. And I was just getting sick of doing the White Sox. But the reason I'm not the general manager ever is because you've got, you know, like you've got, the, you got to stay under what the salaries that the owner wants you to stay under. You've got restrictions based on, um, you know, how much money the team makes. Um, and then, and if you got a team like the Royals, you know they're not going to spend money. That's probably how they are in Out of the Park, too. I'm not, you know, so I wouldn't be able to sign free agents. I can't, sometimes you can't make trades. You go to try to make a trade and it says, no, this puts you over your salary or whatever it is. So I didn't want to mess with all that. So I'm just the manager. I just manage the team on the games that I play. And I have it quick play, and of course, like Stratomatic, you can. There's a way that you can put in your, essentially your CM, 
for the way that you would want the team managed when you're not running the team. So anyway, enough said about that, but yeah, go check out the Royals uh, Out of the Parks. The thing I love about Out of the Park is the graphics are great. Best graphics out there for a replay game that's uh, not like EA Sports or whatever. So, love that. And I am I started a new season um, with Stratomatic Baseball where I basically do a franchise type thing, you know. I start, the base season is the 94 season, and then I grabbed uh, players from each franchise from other seasons and put them on the teams, and we are having a season of that. Uh, I've, right now, the only, as of this recording, the only game that I have up is the opening day game for the White Sox. I am the White Sox, but we've got the 94 White Sox, but it, they also have Carlton Fisk who was not playing in 1994, grabbed him from 86. We have Belton Bill Melton, who was on the 70 White Sox. So, you know, there's White Sox from other seasons. We've got Aaron Bummer in the bullpen from the 2020 White Sox. So we've got that season going on. Look for more games from that. Kind of like with the Royals season, I'm going to skip through uh, games. I'm going to either quick play them or play them, you know, in the background, not on the channel. And then I'll, like, put up, like, maybe, you know, right now we've already done opening day. So maybe the next one will be game 15 or 18 or something like that. Who knows? So, uh, yeah, keep keep uh, tabs on that, especially if you're a fan of an American League team that, played in 1994 you can see how your team is doing how your franchise version of the team is doing so those are seasons that i have currently uh, going oh and i also have a bear season i'm doing the chicago bears uh stratomatic football season from the uh the 2023 or 2022 2022 season um and uh they are probably going to finish, I'm going to say they're going to finish a little better than the actual Bears did, um, because we've already got three wins, and we're only at like maybe game eight or nine or something like that. I'm, I'm not sure offhand. But yeah, look for more Bears season games, uh, at least a few more. I'd say probably at least two or three more before I get to the end of the season. And I'll let you know when that's happening. And then maybe I, uh, you know, who knows? Maybe I'll queue up another team and take another team through the 2022 football season. Um, so so those are the three seasons you got going on. You got the Out of the Park Royals. You've got the, what I call the Atlantic League, which is Stratomatic Baseball franchise teams. And um, although not totally great franchise teams and then you've got the chicago bears other than that i'm you know i'm doing the typical thing let me grab a drink here um i'm doing uh one-off games in baseball uh both card and dice and um I, and occasionally i'll do a computer one-off you know baseball game just two teams match up two teams and throw them up there uh mismatch monday the mismatch mondays uh, from time to time i will do that still dur during the football season but i'm really going to get heavily back into that where i do it almost every monday um you know maybe when the baseball season starts back up but i like i said i will occasionally do one during the football season since I'm doing primarily baseball, and it seems like people really um, respond to Mismatch Monday as baseball. If I try to do a hockey or a football, I don't know. It just doesn't seem to have the same, um, the same appeal. So um, yeah, look for those every once in a while. If I happen to do a one-off game that I think is a mismatch, or if I have a seasonal game that I think is a mismatch from like the Royals season of Out of the Park or from the 
Bears football season, then maybe I'll put it up in, on a Monday and say that it's a mismatch Monday. But, you know, we'll get back into that heavily with baseball once the baseball season starts. Um, and then, you know, and like I said, other than that, you've got your card and dice football every once in a while. I will do that. The next game that I'm going to do is, I don't know what teams I'm going to do, but I'm definitely going to do a 1985 game next. I already did one. I did the Giants, 85 Giants against the 85 49ers. I'm a Bears fan, so you know I'm going to get a Bears game up, but that's like the, uh, you know, that's the main event. I'm not going to go right to the main event like before I've gotten some other games out of the way. Um, and the hockey, I will be doing card and dice hockey. I really love, I'm starting to really love playing the Stratomatic hockey, a card and dice. Love it. The game flows really well. And it's quick, and it's, you know, the pace is nice, and um, I, I just love playing it. So, the next game that I'm going to be doing is from the from last season, the 2022-2023 season. Is that right? Yes, that's right. And uh, we're going to be doing the uh, Oilers, the Edmonton Oilers will be uh, hosting the uh, Vegas Golden Knights, and that is a request game from an Oilers fan. So that should be a really great game to watch. I'm looking forward to playing it, and I hope you're looking forward to watching it. Um, and then uh, I, I think that's about it. I think that's all. I've, that, those are the main ones. Those are the main uh, things that I wanted to hit on. Um, if there's anything you want to see, like I said, uh, drop me a line. You know that I'm going to be doing card and dice hockey, so if there's a hockey matchup you want to see, let me know. Um, if there is a baseball matchup between two teams. With the baseball, you can a request pretty much any te two teams in history. because, um, Or at least any two teams that Stratomatic makes in the cards from history. Because... I have most every set from the past. Um, you know, just give me a request, whatever you want to see. So uh, that, um, yeah, I'm trying to think, and I got nothing else. I got nothing. I got nothing else for you. So um, that's where we are with the channel, and I hope you. I hope everybody keeps watching. Watch more if you can. Put my videos on on your phone and stick them in a drawer if you don't really want to watch because that still helps me. <laughs> so anyway, uh, but that uh, that's that's all I got for right now, and that's going to be it for me, Sportsman Z Bob Zolke, signing off.